Hello, this is Jake with Optimus Futures, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to download the Investor RT trading platform and how to configure the platform to the data feed you have selected. Now, I'm going to approach this tutorial a little bit different. First off, I'm going to assume that you are requesting the Investor RT demo off of our website. And it's not to worry if you are watching this video to learn how to install the platform and configure the platform as well. Feel free to skip a bit ahead. But as of now, I'm going to follow the process that you would take if you have signed up for our, the demo on our website. So you'll need to navigate to optimistfutures.com slash platform slash investor RT, and you will be brought to this page. Fill out all the current fields. And once you have done so, you will be brought to a thank you page. And from here, you can go over to the email address that you have signed up with on our website. I would also suggest to write down this email as well as the password you have selected, as this will now be your rhythmic data feed credentials, which are provided to you for free with a demo of Investor RT. So as you can see, I am now in the email inbox that I registered with on optimistfutures.com. And as you have noticed, you will receive two emails automatically. The first will be from the Rhythmic Administrator account, and it is an activation email for your Rhythmic user ID. So we can click on this link right here, and it'll bring us to rhythmic.com. As you can see, the user ID is the one I registered with on optimistfutures.com, as I mentioned briefly ago. So simply sign in using the credentials you used on optimistfutures.com and you must accept the market data subscription agreement. So scroll down and once you have read through the terms and conditions, left click on I agree. And for one more form that you will need to agree to, this is the market data self-certification. And this form requires you to agree to whether or not you are professional or non-professional. Again, if you aren't licensed, you will be selecting non-professional here. And once you have done so, left click on the submit button. So now that you have agreed to both of the terms and conditions, you can get off a Rhythmics website and go back to the email you registered with. Now up for the second email. And this email will be from the Optimist Futures support team. And these will be the download instructions for your Investor RT demo. So now that we're on this email, we can follow the process step by step. So first up, you'll notice you'll have to click here to activate your subscription. Investor RT actually requires you to sign up on their website and input a credit card for a free subscription. This subscription will last for two weeks and after the two week period, you will begin to be charged. But for those two weeks, the product is absolutely free to demo and use as you like with unlimited use. So I wanted to mention that I have already signed up for the Investor RT demo myself. I've already filled out this form and inputted a credit card, but I wanted to briefly show you just to get you kickstarted on the process. So under the email address field, I would suggest entering in the same email that you used on the Optimus Futures website. And once you have this filled in, you will need to select your product. I would suggest to use the Investor RT, the base version. And once you have selected that, you can add any additional optional packages and service that you would like. But for now, we can leave these blank and we can select continue. Now you'll see here, there is the option for the Investor RT monthly billing. As you can see, it is $50 per month. But as I mentioned before, signing up through the Optimus Futures website will provide you with a free two week trial. After that two week trial period, if you haven't canceled the subscription yet, you will begin to be charged $50 a month. So that being said, for demo access, we will need to continue through this form and fill out all required fields. I've already done so for the sake of time. And now we can continue on to the next step. So now that we have filled everything out, 
you will need to enter your card information in the current field. And as you can see, since you have signed up through the Optimus Futures demo request form, a coupon code will automatically be applied to your checkout, which will provide you with the two week free trial of the Investor RT demo. Once you have entered in all the appropriate information, you can scroll down, read the terms and conditions, and then submit your order. Like I said, I have already done this, so now I am going to sign in to my already registered Linsoft or Investor RT account. So there's one more very important thing that I would like to mention. At this point, it has been assumed that you have already registered on Linsoft.com and have entered in your credit card for a two week free trial of the Investor RT platform. Now, as I mentioned before, if you are signing up for a demo through OptimusFutures.com, you will automatically be provided with a two week free trial of the Rhythmic data feed as well. If you aren't signing up through Optimus Futures and you just are requesting a demo or would like to try out this platform and you happen to be using the CQG data feed to configure the CQG data feed on the platform, you will first need to head over to linsoft.com slash CQG and also be logged in with the account you have registered with. Once you're on this page, simply scroll down a bit and you will see the appropriate section for the CQG end user license agreement. To use the CQG data feed on this platform, you will need to accept this license agreement first for it to appropriately configure. Now, I have already done this on my license account, so I can't show you the exact process, but you will simply need to navigate to linsoft.com slash CQG and click on this field, read through the license agreement, and then accept the terms and conditions. Okay, so now that we are completely registered on the Linsoft site, head back to our instruction email. From here, you can download the Investor RT platform by simply going through the link we have provided for you. So click on the download link and you will be automatically prompted to download the Investor RT platform as you can see here, it is an executable file and you'll most likely find it on the bottom of your internet browser. Simply click on the executable file to begin the installation wizard. Once you have clicked on this, the installation wizard will pop up and we can follow through the steps. First click next. You'll need to accept the agreement. Click next again. Browse for your specified file location. I would suggest this to leave it as default. Click on next. Click on next again. If you need to, I would probably suggest to create a desktop icon. That way you can easily find the platform. Once selected, click next again and then click on install. All right. So now our platform has finished downloading and we can click the finish button to launch InvestRT. Once your platform is initialized, you'll be prompted with the following screen. As you can see, there are multiple options here to select from. I'm going to assume that you are coming from the Optimus Futures demo request form. That being said, you will be using the Rhythmic Data Feed. And because of that, you can select on the broker source option. It's more than likely if you are using this platform, you will need to use a broker source option either way but there are some special circumstances. For example, if you're using anything related to the DTN market access, you may need to select on subscription source or end of the day. Or if you haven't signed up through the Optimus Futures website and you download the platform, you can demo it with unlimited free use using demo source. It is pretty bare bones and it is populated with simulated real-time data using stocks. So that is always an option, but because this is under the assumption that you have followed the Optimus Futures Guide, we'll be selecting Broker Source. And as you can see here, these are the potential data feeds that we can select. As I mentioned for, before, CQG is an option with this platform. You'll simply just need to follow the process that I illustrated before to accept to the license and terms of agreement to use the CQG data feed on this platform. So. 
for our circumstances, we will be selecting rhythmic. And now you'll need to enter in the username and password. This is the email address and the password that you selected on the Optimus Futures website. This is also the email address and the password that you use to confirm the user agreements on the Rhythmic website as well. So that being said, enter in the appropriate credentials and once you have entered them in, click on the next button. This will create a quote page named Rhythmic Symbols containing six sample symbols from the Rhythmic data feed. Once you've been prompted with this box, select OK. And now the platform will automatically restart and reconfigure to the Rhythmic data feed. Now from here, enter in your first and last name in the appropriate field, and then enter in the email address you registered with on the Linsoft website. Not the one you registered with on Optimus Futures or Rhythmic, but on Linsoft. So now that you've entered in that email address, you can click on view your subscription online and it will automatically bring you to a Linsoft page to sign in to this email that you have created on the Linsoft site. So head back over to the Linsoft site and sign into that email. Now you can click on your account in the top right hand corner and click on the drop down menu. And as you can see here, there are a couple of options click on the licenses options. And although I will be blurring out my codes, as you can see here, there are several codes here. The license code, you can copy and paste this, and this will go in the field that is under license code. And as for your user ID number, that is the appropriate field right here for your user ID. Once again, copy and then paste this into the platform. And once you have entered all the appropriate fields, click on activate license. Once you have clicked on the activate license, simply read through the terms and agreements, click on yes, I agree to the terms and conditions of the agreement, and then click on next. Set your appropriate time zone, and then click on next once more. Use the recommended daily backup settings as suggested, click on next. And to complete the license activation process, you'll need to connect to the license server. To do that, click on next once more. And you will now get the request for the license activation. And this may take a few moments, but after patiently waiting, as you can see, my license activation is now successful and I can click on the finish button. This will now bring up the final window. This is where you will need to start your data feed. Click on the OK button. And once you've clicked on OK, you will once more need to enter in your Rhythmic username and password and specify the specific Rhythmic server you would like to connect to. You can keep this Rhythmic 01 by default. So now once you have entered in all these credentials, simply click on Start Data. Once it is connected, click OK, and then you will successfully have an established data feed to the platform and you can begin trading. Thanks for watching. If this video helped, feel free to give it a thumbs up. If you have any further questions, don't hesitate to give us a call or send us an email. Follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more informative content related to the futures market.